Today in the shop we are working on an AKW Generac. This unit's probably about 10 years old. And the problem we're having with is um, idling issues. Um, so I'm here to show you my experience adjusting the idle arm. Here we see the governor arm and the governor actuator shaft coming out of the engine back to the primary spring and the linkage back to the throttle and i'm going to perform the procedure that's in the manual to adjust this arm which is to hold the throttle in full open position which it is that's fully open and to rotate this shaft fully clockwise and then tighten the bolt Okay, the throttle is fully open, and I'm going to use my channel locks, and you can see I can move the shaft. I'm going to hold it fully clockwise, and I'm going to tighten the bolt. Okay, let's crank the engine. Okay, that's what they call hunting. That's what I get every single time I try that procedure. So here's the procedure adjustment I came up with to resolve the issue. First step is let's go ahead and reduce the primary adjustment screw to almost all the way. Okay, now I've got her pretty turned out. And now the next step is I'm going to adjust this back just a hair, and I mean a hair. Probably will be impossible to show this on video, but I'm just going to go back. Right now the whole linkage is turning because I'm not holding it, but I'm just going to let it go all the way. Okay, now it's stopped, and I'm going to just turn it just a hair more. Right there. Okay, now I'm going to tighten that back. Okay, now that the governor clamp bolt is tight, let's try to start it. Okay, so she's still hunting, so I'm going to move it just a little bit more. But she's hunting, hunting at a lot lower RPM. Okay, so I'm going to let her turn together. And just go a hair more. That might have been too much. I'm not sure. Okay, we're going to tighten up the clamp bolt. Try it again. Just make sure you tighten that bolt up every time. Otherwise, it's going to throw you out of whack. Here we go. <laughs> Okay, so now we just shut off an overspeed, so I went too far. So I'm going to take it back just a hair. Okay, I'm not sure if that was enough. I just adjusted it a hair back. Let's try it. Okay, as you could see, that was a lot smoother. The hunting was almost entirely gone. So what I'm going to try to do now is go ahead and ramp up the RPM to 62.5 hertz on my voltage and frequency meter. And then most give it another peak.
I'm very happy with that. Um, I'd like to leave you with, make sure that you tighten this clamp bolt to 70 inch pounds. So I'll grab my torque wrench on that in a second. Just make sure she's tight. And um, I'm going to go ahead and put a load test on it. Make sure she regulates fine and we're good to go. Thanks for watching.